All right, let's uh, start the stream. Dust in Elysian Dale. This game looked pretty fun. So I uh, got it. Oh, no, wait, no, I didn't get it. I got this for... What, Christmas? Yeah, I think so. My roommate got it for me. How nice. Okay. For seasoned players of action games, encounter smarter and tougher enemies. For the elite few who seek impossible odds as each encounter becomes a test of will. Or the mysterious and legendary back. You can never beat the game, only return to main menu. Let me crack open this seltzer. The world has fallen to its great works, long since complete. Its stored civilizations long since fallen to dust. Titular, the greatest legends of Elysium long since forgotten. What was once a land of promise has fallen to the ravages of war. It was in this, our most desperate hour, that the greatest of Elysian tales begin. began. The lone warrior stood against an army, slashing his way through all who opposed him. The mob stood no chance and the soldier showed no mercy as he pressed X to wage war. But despite his victories, his skills, his ruthlessness, the valiant soldier would perish on this day. Well, spoilers! That's like rule number one on my stream, dude. But not to the mob, but to a single child. Huh. Dust. 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 Arise. And awaken, awaken, awaken. What? A talking sword? What are you? A talking sword. Only that which you have summoned. Summoned? How? For what purpose? That I do not know. But we shall learn in time. Now rise. And claim the blade of Ara. I'd rather take the blade of Awu. Oh, there's my furry waifu. Stop! Stop right there! No. And who is she? Me? I'm Fidget, guardian of the sword. <gasps> She's adorable. <laughs> Your name is Fidget. I'm sorry, like a I fidget spinner? I heard before. You said your name was Fidget? I was a fan among children! Hey, this isn't about me. You're the one who's got my sword. How about you tell me your name? I'm bad motherfucker. Uh, Calm yourself, Fidget. His name is Dust. And he is the one who woke me from my slumber. So, Fidget, then? That's me! And you're <laughs> dust? She's adorable! It would seem that way, though I can't recall that name. Um. Should we passively insult her, or should we just be straight and ask? She's too adorable, I don't want to insult her. So, what, what is, is this sword? sword? Sword. I am the Blade of Ara. Yes, you and said you that. Dust are my fated sword it bearer. This has been covered, yes. Yes, well, that's all great and everything, but I think it's about time I got this sword back to the clan. I can't let you just leave with this sword, Fidget. Right now, it's the only thing that knows who I am. I don't even know how I got here. Hmm. Well, then you leave me no <laughs> choice. I, I... I challenge you! The winner gets the sword! Cut her in half. Well, I... All right, all right, you win. <laughs> but don't think I'm leaving empty-handed. I'm coming with you. But, um, I really need the sword back when you're done doing, you know, whatever it is you're doing. What exactly am I doing, Hara? 
What is he doing? The answers you seek lie to the east. There is a path through the glade that leads down the mountainside, and from there you will find a village. That is your first step. Then Me will you give me the sword? I really need to get it back home before anyone notices it's uh, gone. For a sword that doesn't know anything about what he's doing here, he sure knows where I should be going next. When I find out just what it is I'm supposed to do with it, it's all yours, Fidget. Come on, let's go. I hope I can stream this. Butterfly. She's so cute. East is that way. Thus, I should start by going this way. Kill the bunny. Step on it. Wish. Bunnies. Oh! Treasure key. See? See, kids, take this valuable lesson to heart. Do the opposite of what things tell you to do. Hold on just a moment. Sorry about that. Alright, so now let's explore. Can I jump in the water? Nope. Ooh, Schmitzeling. Oh, that's cool. Oh, okay. Oh, do I have to wait for it to charge up again, or did I? How does that work? Ah! Okay, got it. Got it, got it. Combos and such. One, two. One, one, two. One, one, two, two. One, one, two, one. One one two one two. One one. One one. No, oh, 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 wait, wait. One one two one one. Oh. Okay. Got it. Got the combos. Oh, I wonder where I'll find a key for that treasure chest. The Glade plugin. Plug it in. Plug it in. Look at that burn. Up. Down. Alright. Nice to begin a melee combo. Yes. I already know that. What? I <laughs> <laughs> Mysterious wall chicken. Okay, that's definitely uh, a reference to uh, Castlevania. Hmm. What is it, Fidget? Well, my kind has what you'd call a sixth sense. And there's something just ahead. Alright, hold up. My network's being kind of less than ideal. So I'm going to take about like a two minute break and investigate for a second.
Okay, I don't appear to see anything wrong, and yet I am dropping the frames. That's weird. Why is the latency? All right. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to cut the stream here, and I'll try to get it back up as soon as possible. Hopefully, it won't be longer than, like, five or ten minutes. Okay. Hopefully that's better. So far so good. Okay. Hmm. All right, it looks like it's uh still all right. Hopefully it keeps up. Fidget will alert you when treasure is nearby. Fidget is a kleptomaniac. Click R to access the map. Okay, kind of weird. Uh. The Glade plugin. Quests. Materials. All right, I already completed 2% of the game. Character screen. Ooh, RPG. <clears throat> Wall chicken. Neat. All right, good. Not not dropped any frames so far, so at least for the moment, internet seems stable again. I went and turned off some devices just in case. Sucks to have American internet, even though I'm paying for the most expensive possible package. Gigabit down, and yet their up rate is only 34. Like, what the crap, man. Anyways. What am I doing now? I wasn't paying attention, I was ranting. Oops, I guess that auto heals. Ah. Ah. What, what? He always goes that. Oh, it does the other button. Ah. I'm learning. There's an old page. Homework added. All right, we found a chest. We? Correction. We found a locked chest. Well, what are you waiting for? Smash it open. I have uh wise dust. These chests are protected by arcane locks from the last era. Okay, and are well beyond my I have grace. We don't smash chests where I come I from. We'll need a key, then. Only babes. Oh well, that's cool looking. Wait, am I Was that did I just like, <laughs> I'm confused. Did I use a key or did I just like pick the lock? Is that how you use locks or keys? You just, I don't know. I'll stop asking questions. What? Bambi, come back. I won't kill your mom, I promise. Food. Rude. Uh oh. <laughs> Calm yourself, Digit. Dust. Focus. Remember what you've learned thus far. 
Don't worry, take your time. They'll wait. They're very nice like that. But don't be mistaken, they are bad. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh. you to control this power it is unlikely dust that i would awaken from my slumber for such selfish reasons there is a village beyond these woods perhaps finding it will aid in restoring your memories perhaps they have an inhaler to help you with your very whispery breath fidget i think things are about to get a whole lot worse This morning started off so well. <laughs> At least take these people fruits. Something tells me you're going to need them. People fruits. Wait, there's a down? How does this map work? Oh. Yeah, how do we go down from here? Ah. Uh, gotcha. The map's kind of weird, because... It looks like it's from a top-down view, but this is a linear left to right. It's still stable. Is that French toast sticks? Rising Phoenix! I don't like that move though, it doesn't really lead in anything. As far as I can tell, there's no like. Okay, never mind then. Didn't even uh, finish that sentence. Kirby's B up move. Ooh, what's this? Hold here, Dust. You have unlocked a new ability. Bear witness to the Dust Storm. I like it. <laughs> Very much. Attack to perform the Dust Storm, but beware. Skilled as you may be, you cannot maintain the storm for long without hurting yourself. In that case, maybe I can help. 
If you press the super ballistic fidget action button of power, <laughs> it's so spectacularly awesome that it'll produce emotions that didn't even know existed. <laughs> I love this voice actor. Please contain yourselves as I demonstrate. I was not liking her at first, but now, now, you know, coming on to me. <laughs> that was, uh, very pretty. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll just keep the rest of my repertoire <laughs> to myself. I'm sorry, Fidget. I'm sure it'll come in handy somehow. Actually, Dust, between the three of us, this could be quite useful. The Dust Storm can manipulate Fidget's projectile into a more powerful attack. Observe. Huh. Wow. Sugoi! Oh, by the way, every time I use my power, it'll use up a bit of energy meter. You can recharge the meter with melee combos. Yes, Dust. Between your combos and Fidget's own powers, you can achieve a higher hit chain, which will heal bonus experience after each battle. And they're throwing a lot of stuff at me. However, if you are struck by an enemy, the chain will be broken, and you will lose your bonus experience. Forever. All right. I think I understand. Good, because I don't. If this is all too much for you, you can check out the help screen via the pause menu. <laughs> You're Thanks. breaking the fourth I'll wall. I'll take a look if I'm ever in trouble. All right. So, uh, what? Oh, that's cool. Went up, but they never came down. Oh, a little too late there. chicken got it nothing else over there wall chicken
With great power comes great slaughter. Dude in the air, got it. You live here? Be hoping you could tell me. Oh, silly me! I seem to have dropped all my detailed maps <laughs> and navigational equipment chasing after a crazy flying sword. <laughs> I'm sorry I got you She's mixed so up in this adorable. vision. Well, you should be sticking these swords, getting me in trouble. You know, now that I think about it, this isn't the first time I've seen this view. I've stood here before, in this very spot. Right here. Then perhaps you recognize the village at the base of these cliffs? <coughs> it's hard to make out from here. We'll need to drop down to the valley floor if we want to get any closer. Any closer. Oh, hello. Exploded. Now, why am I jump to fly through the air and target enemies? Oh! <clears throat> oh, 
Yummy. Oh. Something explosive should do the trick. Maybe I should play some of my mixtapes. Well, that's not explosive enough. Is that a tent? Is there somebody in there? <laughs> Whatever it is, it's got glowing evil eyes of evil. <laughs> a merchant lies in wait. Do not let his appearance frighten you. I sense he only wishes to assist in our journey. For profit, of course. I wasn't frightened. Just surprised at the, uh, savings. Alright, you're trying too hard. I've been expecting you, stranger. <laughs> what are you buying? Are you? Merely a friend with many wares for sale. You have coin? Shall we conduct business. Uh... Your stuff sucks. Hmm. What does the infinity symbol mean? Oh, is that how much he has to be able to sell me? Got it. What's the max that I can hold? Sell my chickens. Oh, I have a thing. Filthy pendant. Mm. A gift from a young man to his lover. Uh, before you leave, might I propose an offer? All right, but it'll cost you 20 bucks. That would depend on the offer. If I may be so bold, you are not prepared for the journey ahead. I, however, can offer assistance. Please, accept this blueprint as a gift. Should you find a blacksmith and the necessary materials, they may be able to craft the item for you. What do you get out of it? I can offer you materials as well, though ah, I'm not there it is. entirely sure what materials this land deems of value. I am not from around here, as I'm sure you've guessed by now. You from Mexico? You sold me a new material type, I will be able to restock my store with China. As for your reward, I will pay you a bonus for the first Are you Canadian? material you sell me. Ah, he'll buy the okay. I beat you to it, okay? I... Well, yes. <laughs> yes, I will. Thank you. Watch your back, my friend. Which way should I go first? We'll go up here. Oh, more splodies. I should probably, like, heal and stuff. Uh... Wall chicken. A second chance, if you will. Um... Friends found. I don't have any friends. Materials. Okay. So do I sell these to him? Serves no purpose. Sell it. Who buys junk if it serves no purpose? Oh. Neat. I am here to serve. Mm. Tasty cupcake. Maybe two four. Yeah, it's linear. Uh, how many things can I hold at once? Let's see, a lot apparently. Well, then I feel like having more of the ones that heal less would cause me to waste less in healing potential. 
And it costs the same amount of money per healing, so... Your transaction is most appreciated. Yes. Watch your back, my... Okay. Um, how do I use it? Oh, that's the quick item slot. Okay. Ah. Uh, how do I... Okay, I'll figure this stuff out. Don't use wall chicken, because that's waste. Left ring pendant. There we go. Ring armor. That's what I'm using. Wait. Oh, it's a blueprint. Okay. <clears throat> Got it. Okay. Neat. Okay, I'm gonna sell him that junk. I am. Is that what I'm? Oh yeah, currently equipped. Clump of fine cotton. Catalog in stock. Um. Wait. So do I sell them this these materials, or do I hold on to them for the blueprint or something? I'm kind of confused. Purpose wire. Where's the junk? Okay. Um, I will sell one new material catalog. I'm not sure. Well, they're all cataloged at least. Whatever that means. Transaction is the materials you've sold me will be quite useful. I'll attempt to restock them as time goes on. Okay, so you sell him one and then you could buy also more from share him? My stock with other merchants. With our help, you will save valuable time collecting rarer materials. Thank you. I don't quite understand. Watch your back. Neat. Mysterious merchant has asked you to find various materials and sell them to him. He'll give you a bonus for the first new material type you sell him. Okay, so I guess you just sell them all. Uh, I hope this is not a mistake. Why is there not just like a sell all button? What? Oh, I'm buying. Whoops. Well, if there's a reason to buy him, I guess there's a reason to hold on to him. Well, I'll get more money. There we go. Bomb fruit. How long exactly can I do this before I get supposedly hurt? Ah! Whoa! What was that? Did you just hit yourself? <laughs> Dusk, you must take care. Even the greatest of swordsmen cannot maintain the dust storm for that long. That was a pretty long time, though. Uh, yeah, okay. I'll try to be more careful. Keep an eye on your color. If you start turning red and the screen begins to shake, <laughs> you're close to losing it. 
What is this screen you speak of? Just took a, another look at the frames and I have not dropped any, so it looks like my network is good again. So that's good. How do you know it's not in there to protect it from us? Oh, I mean, protect us from it. Well, why would you think that? How do you know it's not just the same lock? It just takes the same key. Oh, well, can't. You can't roll yet. Smooth whetstone blueprint. Dust, there's something up there. Not a problem at all. Stand back. <laughs> all right, I've got it. Wait, no. Oh. What? Having some trouble there? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Aw, <laughs> you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. Out of context. Don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. <laughs> so you're saying I shouldn't keep trying? Oh, well, I didn't. Okay. Ew. Bambies. Looks like we're heading in the right direction. Yep, and the other way's the left direction. Be on your guard, Dust. I sense a powerful foe ahead of you. The deer? He looks Don't cute. Don't worry, Dust. I'll be behind you every step of the way. Way behind. <laughs> Their persistence, I'll give them that. Much as I pity this corrupted beast, <clears throat> now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. Oh, parry. Allow it to strike. Hey, you dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy's strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Timing is crucial. And you must be facing your opponent. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, put this beast out <laughs> of its misery. Finish him. Uh, 
Okay. <laughs> Come on, slime. You're my new friend. Let's go. To eat. I'll eat you. We're in a bit of a hurry, Fidget. Don't worry, I'll feed you later. Feed you to the wolves. Hey, I'm not a pet, but uh, <laughs> would appreciate that. Thanks. So is this thing just dazed forever, or? <laughs> oh, hello! You surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So we're getting closer to the village then? You mean Aurora Village? Yes, it's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. What do you mean? The monster attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I'd swear I heard somebody shouting. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Let's get going. Okay, yes, let's get out of here. Please hurry. Be careful. Yes, I'll bring my friend along. My new slime friend. Fine, I'll just put him out of his misery. No! <laughs> I wanted the experience. <laughs> I get no HP. Bunny, get out of here. Bunnies? Look! Evolved bunnies. Please help us. You look fine. I mean, you look like you're kind of in the middle of something, but you know, I'm not I won't bother you. <laughs> Okay, this this is begging dead to to become a YouTube poop. Don't worry, I think I can handle it. <laughs> Exercise all you learn, dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence. I'm gonna have to edit this video, aren't I? Trying to attack me? Alright, I'm actually gonna need to equip some more healing items. Ah, you bastard. I'll bring it on. Ah, oh, I had like one more hit to do. I can do it, I can do it. Didn't even need to heal. Is that it? Did that last time. <sighs> yeah, I think that's it. Well done, Dust. You have proven yourself a worthy swords master. And none too soon. Bah, they weren't so tough. I could probably take on another four or five of them. You know, if I had to. 
and this was there. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. What happened here? I, I don't know. We were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked. We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. Then the first step of your journey is near its end dust. The village lies just ahead. But what were they doing before the giants attacked? Yes, we arrived. That's great. But what now? I'm just that gonna say been revealed to me. These people are they're doing yoga. That is what is important. But Will you two be all right? <sighs> yes. I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. Not a problem. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak and defenseless. It is? Hey, who are you calling weak? <laughs> I mean... Alright, good luck with that. We're still a little shook up, but I think we'll be fine. I just need to sit here. You got me shook up, shook up, shook up. Oh, My legs. Oh, so you happy. Get the you can. I cleared out quite a few monsters on the way in, but you never know when they'll be back. Did one of those monsters hurt you? Well, I mean, not exactly. This old lug twisted his ankle running away from those monsters. Right. Nice of you to stick around to protect your poor old wife. Yeah, that's what we'll say. I was running to get help. Uh huh. Yeah, lots of help in the tool shed, I'm sure. What, you got a little army hiding in there? Something like that. Maybe I should go. Oh, no, please don't get the wrong idea. I still love my husband, even if he is a coward. Damn. Bah. <laughs> Good one. Oh, by yourself. Oh. Damn, dude, you got roasted. Whoa. Chapter one. Destiny. Aurora Village. Hold it right there. <laughs> Are they gone? I don't hear anything. If you're referring to the giants, I took care of them. They're dead? Yep. Thoroughly expired. They were no match for us. There's an older couple back there that could use some help, though. Yeah, and bring lots of loot. That must have been Oneida and her husband, Gian. Thank you. We'll send help right away. So you're saying you just happened to show up at the right time, huh? Yeah, I happen to kick their ass, too. Interesting coincidence. Sure? If you're suggesting yes. I had something to do with this attack. <laughs> Two things happening at the same time is a coincidence. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. I, I have to apologize for my big friend Caleb here. We're just a little overwhelmed is all. What's been happening here? I guess you missed the endless hordes of bloodthirsty monsters on your way in. They used to stay in the mountains, away from the village. Now they're attacking us on a daily basis. No one's been hurt yet, uh, at least not until today. If giants are showing up near Oneida's farm, things are far worse than we thought. Speaking of which, where exactly do you come from? There's nothing west of here except crazy old Cora. We're, uh... Prospectors! We <laughs> are prospectors! And we're out on an excavation to find, uh, ore deposits. In the mountains! You know, gold, silver, um, manganite? <laughs> Prospectors, eh? You're certainly well armed for the job. <clears throat> like you said, there are a lot of monsters out there. <sighs> well, we're indebted to you either way, so go on through. But I'm watching the two of you. Oh. Please, make yourselves at home. Uh, my name is Bean. There's not much here, but we do have a merchant if you need supplies. Thank you. We'll be on our way then. 
Thanks so much for your help. Please, make yourselves at home. How are you two holding up? Don't worry about us. I'm in no rush to take on a giant, but I think we're in the clear. That's an interesting outfit you're wearing. Oh, you're one to talk. <laughs> can your friend even see from under that hat? He can see everything. <laughs> it's really, really. No reason to get defensive. Just trying to help. Prospectors, fidgets, that was the best thing you could come up with? <laughs> it was the first thing that popped into my head. It's not like you had anything better. Come on, let's get away from these guards. All right, Ara. Where to now? You're right where you need to be. The answers to your identity lie somewhere in this village. How do you know? I know this place, and that's for certain. I'm sure I've been here before, but nobody seems to recognize me. You're a and ghost. You in turn do not recognize them. Yet I feel there is something here that may yet trigger your memory's return. Maybe we should look around for a bit then? If you really have been here before, maybe somebody will recognize you. That chance. That is a good idea, Fidget. Let us meet with the townspeople. I am certain that the next step of your journey will reveal itself in time. As a quest in your inventory. Very well. But something... something here is making me uneasy. Like the calm before a storm. Dust to dust. Did I level up at all? Uh, yeah, I guess I'll get defense. It's taking too much damage from the bosses. I ain't saying he's a quest giver. Why, hello there. I'm always thrilled to see a new face. Even when it's all covered up like yours. Indeed. Well, my name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Hiya! Don't mind Mr. Grumpy. He's not big on the whole eye contact thing. <laughs> Fidget and Dust, eh? Not from around here, are you? Well, neither was I originally. But I can it's tell. a nice little place, if you're not in a hurry. Oh, uh, where are my manners? I'm Augustin, local strongman. Say, you want to arm wrestle? Uh, some other time, perhaps. We hey, just passed. I want to arm wrestle. Ah, oh, that's a shame. Thought you looked like the arm wrestling type. He is. You know, I heard what you did back there for Oneida. Great stuff. Maybe we can help each other out. Okay. Uh, twenty bucks. Maybe. What did you have in mind? I have an old friend, a blacksmith, lives way up at the top of Archer's Pass. I promised I'd deliver some materials to him way back when, but haven't been up that way in ages. Area's pretty dangerous these days, if you ask me. Maybe you could deliver them for me? Uh. Tell you what, if you help me out, I'll give you this blueprint. If you give it to him along with these spare materials, he'll set you on your way right quick. A blacksmith that can craft items from blueprints? I think I'll take <laughs> you up on that, Augustine. What a madman! Oh, great! I knew I could count on you. When you see him, just tell him that old Augustine says hello. <laughs> Jess? Uh, good morning? Hmm, is it though? I, well, I guess? He guesses. Wonderful. Well, perhaps you can guess that I really don't want to talk such drivel right now. Go. Scurry off and leave me be. What kind of accent is that? What? Oh, I just... <laughs> I forget that when you level up, you explode. Appreciate the mirror finish this whetstone offers a lot of pointy bits.
Tasty cupcake. Lorne Spark. Mm. Treasure chest? That reminds me, how many keys do I have? Uh... Three. Mosca. Hello! I don't believe I've seen you before. We just came in from the west. Ah, oh, so you're the one everyone is talking about! This voice sounds familiar. Everyone's talking? Of course! You're the one who saved Oneida! Uh, my name is Mosca, and I am at your service. If you need anything, just let me know. Muska, Mosca, Mickey, Mouse. Say, are you, uh, are you staying long? Uh, it'll go down eventually. I don't know. Why do you ask? Well, if you ever find yourself heading east of the village, maybe you could let me know if the roads are safe? Oh, they're far from safe. The town guards mentioned that monsters have been attacking all sides of the village. You're better off staying inside the walls for now. Well, see, here's my problem. I I've been needing to visit someone in Denim. It's a small village on the edge of Abadi's forest. Abadi. I imagine this someone is pretty Abadi. important to you. Well, yeah. See, it's about a girl. Well, surely she's worth the danger. Oh, she is. She definitely is. I just... I, I want to make sure she's okay. With all these monsters around, there's been no word from Denim at all. Mosca, if my travels take me there, I'll let her know you're thinking about her. Is Denim a, a, a woman's name? Oh, thank you so much! You're great! You're really, really great! I thought it was just pants material. Save my keys. You, you're perfect. Oh well, I don't like to toot my own horn. Um, thanks. Not you. Listen. <laughs> Do you hear it? Can you hear its whispers locked within, within the box, my box? Whoa. I don't hear anything. Well, of course you don't. My box has been lost. Somebody must have stolen it. Perhaps it was that Mosca fellow. He's always averting his gaze from me. Like he's hiding something. Probably his distaste for your nuttiness. <laughs> I can hear its whispers coming from below. Down, deep down in the earth. If you're ever down there, please, you must find my box and return it at once. And whatever you do, do not open the box. Okay, Reed. If I find your box underground, I'll be sure to bring it back. He's not talking about that chest down here, is he? This is technically a box underground where he is. Yeah, that's probably not it, though. He's a bit worn out, saving the village and everything, you know? I love you. I heard something about that. Ah, uh, yes. Well, good. Honestly, it doesn't matter. They'll just keep coming back. I... Debbie Downer. And there's nothing we can do about it. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna go hang myself. I didn't introduce myself before. My name is Dust, and my companion here is Fidget. It doesn't matter. Life is meaningless. Dust? Really? Is something wrong? We're all gonna die no, someday. I, I'm sorry. It's just an interesting name. I'm Ginger. Oh, and about those people you saved. We're just gonna die anyways. Yes. 
Well, that was a noble thing to do. So thank you. Oh, wait. oh my box. Where is my box? Do you have my box? I must have it back. Find it, please. <laughs> She's a cheerful one, huh? A bit of gratitude might have been nice. But she literally said thank you. What the fuck? Hey, ease off, Dust. She looked like she was pretty depressed. I, I don't know why I said that. I'm sorry, Fidget. I, I don't know what came over me just then. Come on, let's keep moving. Maybe it's the balls coming out of your abdomen. Ooh. Ah, our famed savior. I had hoped you'd come. <laughs> Welcome to my humble shop. This guy kind of sounds like David Cross. Just a little for hunger. Dang, that's so much gold. Just for one? Ooh. Uh, so expensive though. Doesn't matter who I sell this to. I guess not. Thank you for coming in. I can almost guarantee your satisfaction. Almost. beats well you ever heard of a fat beat i'll hide it in the caves beneath the river until i found the keys i need just remember to jump as far to the right as i can it's a box you can't open it don't look in the box do not open the box. You can look at the box, but that's it. Fell into a hole near the storage cave in Aurora. Well, I can't go down holes yet. How do we go back to notes? Uh... I guess I don't. Ah. Climbed out to the hand and made a leap of faith. Let me try something quick. What is a oh, child hey. doing all the way up here? Are you travelers? Isn't that dangerous? Maybe you can help me? I can't find my little brother, Corbin. Oh, he's dead. He's not in the village? 
He got eaten by wolves. No, he's not here. I can't find him, and I've looked absolutely everywhere. Don't worry, I'll keep an eye out for him. What's your name? My name is Colleen. Oh, I wonder if he left the village. He could get hurt. Calm down, Colleen. I'll look for him. Where did you see him last? Well, he was in the mouth of a wolf. Mr. Gianni, but whenever I ask him about Corbin, he says he's too busy. I really don't like that guy. Gianni, huh? Okay, wait here. If you find Corbin, please bring him home. I'm really getting worried about him. <laughs> I thought a meteor just fucking smushed her. There's another chest here. I want to save my keys, though. If you find Corbin, please bring him home. I'm really... <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> Noob. <laughs> Who's I supposed to be looking for? What's his name? It was no, not that. Yes. Gianni, I want to ask you about a boy named Corbin. Ah, have you seen him? Where has that foolish boy run off to? He's not with you. I was hoping you could tell me. I have not seen he him. He must still be wasting time in Ivydale Glen. I just knew I shouldn't have trusted that boy with cleaning my fabric. <laughs> this guy's like a, a South American accent. Corbin is doing your laundry outside the village? <laughs> I do not see why this is so difficult to comprehend. But then I suppose you don't have the capacity for rational thought. Rational if you are thought. so concerned, maybe you should go look for him instead of waffling about. Oh, I'll find him. Then we're going to have a little chat. With the sharp end of my sword. You mentioned which direction they were in. So, have you found my fabrics? F what an asshole. Hmm. So, have you found my fabrics? I'm getting awfully cold. Please, take a break. You've earned it. Well, if you say so. I All right, I'm gonna cut the stream offer, here. But it's Thanks, guys, for coming. Before I can rest. You really ought to be better equipped in case anything else comes through here. Nonsense! I crafted this spear myself. Bro, do you even spear, bro? <laughs> it's very nice. All right, that's enough. Why don't you two leave me alone now? <laughs> Oh, there's a a hub uh, or an overworld. Good day. I'm Mayor Bram. Hi, Bram. So you're the hero I've been hearing about. It's nothing, really. We're just passing through. No need to be modest, my friend. We can't thank you enough for your help. 
Things have been rough in Aurora of late, so having a true hero in our midst is really boosting morale. So, what's your name, son? Dust. My name is Dust. And Dust is my name. I've met, some people call me quite as Dust. As you. But just call me Dust. Ah, are you talking about the Watchmen? You must understand, hardly a day goes by without some monstrosity attacking our peaceful village. They were simply being cautious. Take my word. I'm sure they meant no ill will. And there was also this girl. Girl? Yes, that could only be Ginger. She can be a bit of a handful, but don't pass judgment on her like that. You have no idea what she's gone through. She can be a bit of a handful. She looked pretty upset about something. Don't concern yourself. We have other matters to discuss. What help could I possibly provide? A few giants in a field seem like the least of your problems. Yet again with the modesty. You're no mere travelers, that much I've gathered. Mineral merchants don't wield blades as impressive as yours. Oh wow, word Please. spreads quickly. We really could use the help. I don't know. I'm searching for something myself. Then perhaps we can help each other. If you help our village, I promise I'll do whatever I can to help you. But I can be of no assistance while our village is constantly attacked by these creatures. We suspect their leader is close by, and what? you could... Whoa, 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 you hold on a second. You're saying those mindless thugs have a leader? And you somehow know where they are? Stop scooping shit and give me answers. Until recently, they would attack us in small groups. Nothing we couldn't handle. Now, they coordinate attacks on a much larger on scale, medium groups. On Too big sides, for us to handle. Our forces apart. I assure you, whatever leads these things is experienced in warfare. What do they want? Our land, I imagine. Just a casual observation, but... Our land and our time. loins. Well, whatever it is, it's become a serious problem. If you truly are as capable as I hear... You want us to find their leader? It certainly would cripple their advance. You'd be doing the entire village a great service. Assassination? Got it. How about it, Dust? Well, I... I do like taking part in justified murder. You feel a conflict of emotions. This is good. I will abide by your decision, Master. Do it. I trust you to take the right path. Helping this do village it. is the right thing to do. But it's more than that. It's almost like... Like I know these people. Like I have to help them. I think that strange feeling you've got is a little foreign concept called compassion. I'm proud of you, Dust. Yeah, well you can't spell compassion without like ass. Your face off. Charming as always, Fidget. I think you've made a wise decision. Alright, Mayor Bram. <laughs> you've convinced us. We're, We're gonna go murder. To stop these attacks. <laughs> That's my boy. My the boy. Watchmen reported increased monster activity to the east of our village, so I imagine that's where you should go. But do be careful. Strong as you may be, I've seen many fine warriors lose their lives in these monstrosities. I understand, Mayor. I'll be careful. And I'll be back. Fail. Hey, you're the outsider. Yeah, that's me. That's great. So you must know your way around out there. Maybe you could do me a favor. Maybe you could do me a favor and explain why everybody here seems to have a unique accent. Depends on the favor. What is it you need? Didn't you all, like, you know, grow up here? Well, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Fail, and I'm in charge of keeping our guards well equipped. Oh. So their poor equipment is pretty much your fault. <laughs> In so many words, yes. It's not like I enjoy giving them subpar equipment. If I had better materials, I could make better gear. Sure. Tell you what, if you could bring me five imp hides, I would gladly buy them off you for more than the shop will offer. Hmm. I'll keep my eyes open. Much appreciated. I'll be waiting right here. Do I happen to have any? No. Um, how do I get to that stuff again? Is 
one. Please, let me know if you come across those materials. I'll keep my eyes open. Much appreciated. I'll be waiting right here. Neat. Oh, she's eating. That's so adorable. Abadi. <laughs> Archers pass. Asshole. This man gets only we have a resident general. Ah. Wait, what? Oh. Yeah, okay. Do you hear something flapping? <laughs> what? Uh, that isn't you? <laughs> Hey, I don't make that much noise. Wait, you're right. Look out, we've got company. Bad company. I can't deny. Hey. Hey. <laughs> he hit me, dude. Get back here, Spyro. for the next level. went so high up in the air, I went to the area above me. again. Wait, wait. Ah, I'm learning. It's over here.
Why do I feel like I'm going slower? Ooh, statue. Wasn't there something about a statue? Hello again, my friend. I suspected you would return. Hmm. Yes. Give me the lover pendant. Your transaction is most appreciated. Your mom. Sharpened nails of an abbey. Is it you from a slime creature? Oh, that's nasty. That's stone giant. I got his rocks off. Your transaction is most approved. Watch your. What do you have to sell? Oh. oh, I do need more healing items. Your trans. Aha! Uh -huh. What? All these chests, and I like haven't gotten any new keys. There's something about taking a leap of faith from a palm or something. Yeah, to Archer's Pass. The narrow my leg it caught up with me the headless statue. Headless statue. Climbed out to the hand and made a leap of faith. Headless statue, he did. Is this a headless statue? No, it is a head full statue. A head more statue, if you will. Ah! Well, that worked. That was a lot easier. Um, 
This is a pretty headless statue. Is that it? Oh, that's a foot. I was like, is that like garlic? And, uh... Oh wait, no, that's not the one. That's the one I want. Easy. Another chest? Ah, here we go. And then he took a leap of faith. Finally. Wall of chicken. Um, yeah, let me go back. Oh, they're back. Well, that's easy experience. How did that not hurt me? Oh, you have to buy a teleport stone? Kinda lame. Well, okay, where am I? Alright. Oh, you got me. You got me, you got me. Wait. Oh, down here.
Oh, she's sleeping now. It's so cute. Bunny's not afraid. Helping those people out? We're doing our best. That's a good boy. <laughs> How's you about some cookies, dearie? All right. Wait, aren't you? Ah! It's, oh, isn't that a permanent five health boost? Huh, isn't that that a uh, super meat boy? That's neat. So friends are just like cameos of other Indie games. Neat. Too late there. Oh, come on, I hit it that time. What the frick? I held it down! No, don't use the revival stone. Damn it! Asshole.
dirty ring. Ooh. Oh, come on. You just gotta wait, not attack. So apparently you can't do it just after attacking. That is the mistake I made. Another dirty ring blueprint. Wait, ah. Uh... <laughs> Hello, friend. Ooh, purple resonance gem. Enough fidgeting. This place looks a little dusty. I'll see myself out. Alright. Save things over here, isn't it? Wait, what was that? What was that icon? Do that icon again. Fine. Oh, it's you're out of mana. No. Where's that save spot again? Oh, right, it was down here. Duh. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna take a break from this game here. And, uh... What time is it? What the frick? It's 1.21 in the morning? What the hell? I thought it was like 11 o'clock. Huh. Well, uh, I guess I'll just, uh, have to stream tomorrow today. So, thanks for checking out my stream. Um, it's a pretty fun game. I do rather like Fidget. She's adorable. And, um, uh, I like the combos. It's a neat idea. I feel like there maybe could have been more combos. Um, maybe there are more later, who knows. Uh, I don't like that you can't just teleport between these save spots without using an item. Uh, otherwise, yeah, it's a pretty solid game. Pretty good artwork. Um, decent, decent voice acting. Not amazing, but decent. Could have been much, much worse. Uh, the lines are a little... Okay, I'm nitpicking now, but yes, it's a really beautiful, neat game. And I do like <laughs> doing that. Also, I like the sharp air control. Just instant left and right, no acceleration. No momentum. Hell yeah, dust. Oh man, are you just joining right now? That's a shame. I was just gonna end the stream, but I'll tell you what, I'll play another like 15 minutes. Just cause you, you wanted to come and hang out with the old Z. Um, okay, now that I have that purple thingy, 
don't, don't I have a thingy for this? How do I do this? Baked Z. B. Zealot Z. Zealot Z. Z Zealot. Zealot. Okay, I think I got a purple thing, but I don't know. I think I'm supposed to be able to, like, open this now or something? Um, purple resonance gem. Open all gem gates of the same color. Is this not purple? Uh, I guess not. Oh, it's blue? Really? Oh. It looks the same to me. Uh, I guess slightly different. Okay. Ah. Get back here. Hey. No hitting me. Oops. Do I have max coins? Do you only get 999? Aw. I should be spending more money. Oh no, okay, it just happened to have 999 right there. <laughs> Yeah, it's really cool. Uh... Okay, I'm leaning either toward fidget or attack.
You heathen. <laughs> Ringer of death. Ah, hello again, my friend. We're not friends. I suspected you would return. What? Augments. Whoa. Plus six attack. Yes, please. Two defense. Wow, oh, I should have been buying stuff a long time ago. That's it. Oh, okay. They're so expensive, that's dumb. You should just be able to teleport whenever. Whenever you're at a safe spot. Transaction is most appreciated. Thank you. Neat. I've just been like playing on hard mode practically. Didn't have anything. Dirty blue. Dirty, dirty ring. Oh, crap. Woo! That was some quick thinking my fingers did. Oh, this is the headless statue. All right, leap of faith. Oh, come on! I took, I had too much faith, too much faith there. Oh, come on. There we go. Uh. Oh, wonderful. Chests I can't open. Oh, is that the exit? <laughs> when you have too much faith and start seeing the light. Go back. I'm 
Need Lethal League Blaze. Lethal League is like that, like, uh, like ball game where you have to spike it and stuff, right? I don't have any keys. That game looks fun, but it's like you gotta have people to play locally with, don't you? Those guys are so easy. They look pretty fun, yeah. Oh. What's over here? <laughs> Come back, chicken. <laughs> oh, there is online? Alright. Just dominated by good players, and not, then not even much of them play anymore. Oh. Yeah, that happens. That's the unfortunate, like, transience of multiplayer games. They live, and then they die. Okay. Is this also blue? Because it looks pretty damn purple to me. Maybe I just see blues and purples the same. I'm, like, blue colorblind. Alright. Well, good to know. I'll just stand here and get my free money and experience. game but fucking casuals man can't handle it fucking plebs get off my game or get good okay another safe thing There's a game I used to absolutely love, like, straight addicted to, but the devs kept changing it, and then eventually it just turned into something I didn't like anymore, which is a real shame. Learning curve, but not that high, I must normally see it as a couch game. Yeah. Oh, finally key. Oh, what? What am I doing? Was I supposed to be able to do that? Oh, I'm on fire. Stop, drop, and roll. Okay, how did I do that? I just kept... What? He won't do it now. That was weird. I just kept attacking, it kept, like, making me climb. That was weird. I can't do it again. Strange.
Whoa. Uh, Whoa. Hello there. <laughs> that guy has cool hair. <laughs> Easy there, Chief. <laughs> Everyone, calm down, please. So, you were the ones making all that noise up there. Uh, could have been the monsters exploding, uh, but intentionally. Uh, by the way, do you know you have blobs in the attic? <laughs> oh, those. Oh. They don't bother us. And they tend to keep the other monsters away. If I knew we were having company, I'd have cleared them out myself. Sorry about that, I guess. Yeah, you're real sorry. Um, so I used to play Awesome Knots, which is like, uh, it's a MOBA, but it's a platforming MOBA. And it used to be so freaking cool. But they like, they, they changed the game mechanics and it just kind of sucks now. It's like horribly unbalanced and... It suffers from the same problem where not many people play it except for like the super hardcore players. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah man, that was my thing. That's still the most played game on my Steam account and I haven't played it in years. So what brings you to this far outside Aurora? I'm assuming that's where you're from. I'm Dust, and this is my companion, Fidget. We're here to deliver these materials on Augustine's behalf. Oh, well, nice to meet ya. I'm Haley, and this is my brother, Maddie. Reflex Arena. I don't know that one, actually. <laughs> don't mind him. I see you've got a blueprint there. Mind if I take a look? Well, I'll show you, or I'll show you mine if you show me yours. Tell you what, if you can find me the materials for it, I'll craft this item for you. Oh, a filthy ring that serves no purpose. Plus two luck. <laughs> Little else. Let's see. I need blue shiny. I need gray brain matter. Oh, what? Why is this so powerful? <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. Tinkerer. Neat. Thanks, Haley. And, uh, just because I like you, I'll give you a blue resonance gem. Don't know Is that what the kids call it these up, days? But there's a big blue door at the foot of Archer's Pass that this will open. Oh, you mean all the purple ones? Yeah. Just inside the door is a teleporter that'll take you right up here. Makes return trips a lot easier. So you can come and visit anytime you like. Oh. I'll be honest, even with a shortcut at the foot of the pass, I'm not sure I'll be able to make it up here too often. God tier arena shooter, just no marketing at all. My dad did have these little receiver things he'd give to his regular customers to transport goods back and forth. Unfortunately, I don't have any of them to give you. Let me think. If I remember correctly, one of my dad's customers dropped one somewhere in Abadi's fort. If you were to find it, I can craft your items and send them to you through the receiver whenever you want it. Well, that's convenient. Dad normally gives his customers a blue resonance gem, so check for blue resonance gates in Abadi's forest. Need anything else? Uh, let's talk. So, let's talk. I notice it's only you and Maddie up here in the pass. Is it just you two? Not all the time, no. My father still runs the forge, but he's usually away on business. Right now, he's somewhere across the sea, hunting down new minerals and ores. He's always trying to make better weapons and armor. Sounds like he's always pretty busy. Yeah, but I get along fine by myself. And Maddie too, of course. I meant to ask before, does Maddie have a problem with me? He's just got his head stuck up her ass. What? Well, it's just, he seems to grumble a lot around me. I can attest to that. <laughs> Lots of grumbling. <laughs> I really can't say, Dust. Maddie, do you have anything to say? Yeah. 
Well, I hope that answers your question. Uh, not really, but... Let it go, Dustin. Just let it go. <laughs> so, is blacksmithing the official family trade, then? In a way, I guess. My father said I could be whatever I wanted. But when you grow up alongside a world-famous blacksmith, your options are fairly limited. It was this or business school. Not that I mind, though. It's nice to have skills that are in demand these days. Everybody always needs something forged, whether it's amulets or armor. So, business is good? <sighs> it's... well, it's been better. Still, we make enough to keep things going, and that's the important thing. Your forge is pretty far off the beaten path, Haley. Why set up shop so far outside Aurora? This forge is actually quite ancient. My father's 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 father inherited it from his mother's grandfather on her father's <laughs> side. Plus, you can leverage the fact that people don't want to walk away empty-handed after climbing all the way up here. It was built during the Battle of Archers Pass many hundreds of years ago. The archers were holding off their enemies from way up here, but they needed a forge to replenish their arrows. So they built one right where they stood. It helped them take archers past, and from here, they were able to liberate the whole valley. Hence, it's named Archers Pass. Sounds like this forge has a lot of history behind it then. Even so. Location, location, location. <sighs> yeah, I hear what you're saying. I wish it was more accessible. We'd get more business, I'm sure of it. But it's not like we can just pick it up and move it. I'll bet if you had an army of trained rats, we could move this place no problem. <laughs> they came out of nowhere. Uh, fidgets, I don't think that'd help. You know, smart mewing rats with magic! Is that a reference I'm not getting? Don't worry about her dust. Altitude sickness. Drive some creatures crazy. Fidget was pretty crazy before. Maybe we should be on our way. Need anything else? Uh, nope. Thanks, Dust. Don't be long coming back. I'll be long all day. That went incredibly well. Do you know why? I don't know, Fidget. Why? Oh, don't be so dense. It's because she likes you. I did not pick up on Fidget, that. Fidget, what are you talking about? You didn't see the signals? She was giving you the signals. I did not see the telegraphs. That's great, Fidget. Really, I'll keep that in mind. Whee! Wait, wasn't there a blue thing up here? Probably shouldn't have jumped down. Or wasn't. Oh, it was right here. That's what you were talking about. Okay. Um. <laughs> Wait. 
Did I equip the stuff I had or make me... No. <laughs> Didn't I have her make me more than one thing? Thanks for joining Zealot, always fun when you're around. Um, I'm gonna hit the hay. Have a good one. Night night.